Well, students, teachers, and school districts all across our state are reacting to today's news about the possibility of reopening our schools, and there are lots of different opinions among them. Here's News 13's Brady Wakayama. Dean Albuquerque Public Schools just released its reaction to today's announcement, saying they are assessing their reentry plan and many factors have to be considered before they make a decision on how to return. However, two of New Mexico's teachers unions say they are pleased with today's announcement and are happy to work with the state and the public education department to get kids back in school with COVID safe practices in place. Some of those practices include upgraded air filter and ventilation systems for schools, ongoing surveillance testing, as well as sanitation and isolation protocols. People I spoke with in Albuquerque were split on today's news. I don't think it's ready yet. Uh... Uh, things are improving from what I hear here in Albuquerque and New Mexico, but uh, there have been children who are dying. I've gone back to school in some of the bigger cities, and, and that scares me. I think it's great. Uh, kids are not meant to stay home and be isolated. Rio Rancho Public School says they're also waiting to get more information from PED before moving forward reopening school to middle and high schoolers. Elementary students in the district are already in hybrid learning and the district says they will use a similar model they used with those students with the older students. Now the education advocacy nonprofit New Mexico Kids Can says this is an important step forward making sure they that every student and family has the option to choose what is best for them. Dean, back to you. All right, Brady, thank you. Now the daily numbers.